always have injected brisket since I started competing. All right, now when you inject, you make sure you inject with the grain. With the grain. I basically done everything that you possibly could do, uh, with very few exceptions in barbecue. Now I get to watch my son. I get to watch my son Michael taking those steps up the ladder uh, in his career. If he has any question, have any issues, I'm the dad that can answer for him. Don't cross inject. All right. If you cross inject and go across the grain with it, it's going to leave discoloration in your slices. So you need to make sure you see the grain running like this. You need to make sure you're injected with the grain. We barbecue men. We're the barbecue warriors. I'm chief cook and owner at Jack's Old South, and we're here at Rocky Mount, North Carolina, with my brother, my son Michael, and the good Bill, all here trying to kick everybody's ass. I formed Jack's Old South in honor of my dad, Jack Mixon, back in 1996. And since then, I've won over 200 grand championships, three world titles, close to 40 state championships, about 12 national championships, prize money totaling around a million. Basically, if I've won everything, done everything that I want to do, you know, I walk around with a target on my back, being the winningest man at barbecue. Anybody in their right mind wants to be Myron. I want to knock him off a spurch. I've been cooking against Myron for 15 years, and I've beat Myron before, you know, it'll be some good competition. All these wannabes want what I got. And guess what? I don't give up what I got easy. <laughs>